idea. You're not actually swallowing any of that crap, are you? I have to give him a chance, at least. He's only standing right there, guys. He's only right there. Hey, we got Lightning's knife, which is a something. What? Is that the artifact? This is Lightning's knife. I keep it in my room, but how did it get out here? Are we gonna have like a flashback now? There's just been cutscenes all over the place. Hey, look there. <laughs> Wow, oh, I already forgot that kid's name, and I feel really bad. Come on. Okay. It's her knife. I found it near the base of the pillar. No. Uh, Sarah, I'm sorry. She must be inside the pillar. The lightning's holding up Cocoon. Along with the Neil Wait, what are you talking about? She was right here a second ago. I saw her. He talked. She gave us her blessing. Snow and I were getting married. She laughed and said congrats. But then, all of a sudden, lightning disappeared. She was gone, like she was never there to begin with. No one else remembered her smiling and laughing. No one but me. All your friends think your sister is inside that pillar. I was scared. People said I was dreaming. They said... They said I was just making up stories so that I didn't have to face the truth. Listen, Sarah. Your memories are the truth. Lightning is alive. The question is, why are you the only one who remembers? Well... Perhaps history changed somehow. You mean, your memories are true, but history was altered afterwards? Of course, that's not really possible. I know that. But I just don't understand how I can remember it so clearly when no one else can. Weird. The knife looks like it's been polished. Maybe someone was cleaning it out here and then forgot about it. I don't think this is our artifact. That is pretty weird. Sorry to tell you, the mountain path is off limits. Cadeau's orders. We can't go near the meteorite right now. Wait, I remember. Wasn't there another path along the shore? Now that you mention it, there is another route along the shore that the surfers use. There's a path that appears when the tide's low. You can't use it right now, though. Huh. Well, it doesn't matter. What Fuck you, you and your rules. Watch it. Don't go that way. Yeah, we're just gonna we're gonna we're gonna keep going. <laughs> We're gonna keep going, and uh, we're just gonna we're just gonna disregard those rules. There we go. Back into random random battle frenzy. Let's do dual castings. Check this shit out. 
Ah, oh, that was very cool. Yay. <laughs> Alright, Mog. I'm glad there wasn't too much damage done. Yeah, me too. Remember how I'm not, like, supposed to be here? I like how no one really gives a crap. Crap, that's just not what I wanted to do. Dual casting, there we go. Awesome. There we go, now we can shift into double trouble. Okay, so... <sighs> Freaking kid! The hell? The hell is he running from? Okay, where is that? There, there we go. Uh, I guess for once I didn't get attacked, which is good. Do it! Holy shit! Noel, you were getting messed up. Awesome. Oh, we got another power wristband. Okay. Where is this kid going? Why does he have our shit? Hit the- are you fucking serious? Wow. Auto orientation fail, part two. What the fuck? Seriously. Yes. Freaking auto orientation. Ooh, we can't hit small objects because we're retorted. Way there, to go. Now we've got you. Mm, Miss Farron? Why did you run away? I promise I won't get mad if you tell me. I know you say you won't get mad at me, but I can't tell you. I don't want to get yelled at. The kid was trying to get away from Mackie. I bet you anything he was up to no good. More than likely. Hmm. You were running from Mackie, weren't you? Did you do something you weren't supposed to? I was watching him work on the robots. And then I saw it and I just couldn't help myself. <laughs> this ought to be good. And then what happened? Great. Huh. I hope you're not misbehaving. It makes me sad when my students don't behave. I'm sorry, Miss Farron. Guess I'll own up. The truth is, I sold something from Mackie. And that's why he was chasing you? What did you take? This necklace. It belongs to you, doesn't it? Okay. Wait, wait. Well, that was weird. What was he doing with this anyway? That belongs to Mackie, doesn't it? No, it's mine. It's a reminder of a promise a good friend made me. Sarah, I believe you. 
Your sister's alive. She's out there somewhere. Thank you, Snow. Here, you hang on to this for a while. When I come back, it'll be with lightning. Then there's no way she can say no to us getting married. Okay. Okay. And that was the last time I saw snow. The memories I had of lightning standing on the plain beneath Cocoon. He was the only one who believed. Believed them enough to do something. That's why I've been waiting here. And doing nothing, right? Lightning and snow are long gone, but you still sit here and wait. Why didn't you go after them? I have faith in Snow. He is a hero after all. And has that faith been enough? Neither of you want to be apart, yet here you are alone. Don't you think I know that? Sorry, I shouldn't have said that. But you tell me, what good is a hero if he's never around? Well, it does make an interesting point. Okay, why are you... Oh, great. Well, because we can't go that way. So... <laughs> this has been... This has been fun, eh? Well, let's get into this battle. I guess we'll end it there for now, after this. Build up this chain here. Ship back into double trouble. If things worked out for the better. As we get a potion, joy. Well. It wasn't the artifact after all. Are you losing your touch, Mog? Poo -poo. It's not his fault. Come on, let's head back. So it is Mog, but it's probably not Mog from Final Fantasy VI, which would be very cool. Anyway, we'll end it here for now, and uh, this should be up in a couple hours or something. So thanks for tuning in, guys, and I'll see you later. Peace out. <laughs>